has only just begun. Revenge is a dish best served cold. Quintessence. I am Nerissa, and I have brought you here to take your rightful place. Among the Knights of Vengeance! When the gem pulsed this morning, I knew my time had come. No more need for knights or vengeance. All that remained was to convince you to give it to me willingly. Which is why I fed you false visions of your parents. Monster! Too slow, whelp. The heart of Meridian is mine! But I sensed the power of the heart was corrupting Nerissa. To save her soul, I took the heart away and gave it to Cassidy. But Nerissa became obsessed with her lost power. After begging and pleading, she demanded Cassidy return the heart. Cassidy refused. Devastated, Nerissa fled, but I imprisoned her, hoping she would redeem herself by facing her guilt. I fear I may have erred. What have I... What have they done to you? Welcome back, Cassidy. So, how long's it been? Forty years. You haven't aged a bit. You've aged many bits. Draining our life force for power, are we? Granted, you had the sad disadvantage of having to live in this world while I... I apologize for any role I might have played in your accident. Might have played? <laughs> That's like me saying I might have missed curfew on prom night. <laughs> oh. Come on, Rissy, give it up. We've toured Heatherfield up, down, and sideways. It's not gonna happen. So send me home. If home is where the heart is. Hello? Is someone there? Mom? It's Nerissa Emily. I didn't mean to startle you. Oh, the garden looks lovely today. Thank you, Nerissa. And don't apologize, dear. You know Cassidy's old friends are always welcome here. Thank you, Emily. Uh, that locket. Is there a picture inside? Mm, my, your memory's worse than mine. I've shown you this before. It's Cassidy, of course. Oh, Mom. Now you wait here. I'll get us some lemonade. She misses you terribly, Cassidy. Oh, I'd give anything. Anything. There's nothing to give. Just show some mercy to your mother and say the words. Say you want to live. I want to live. Compassion is a powerful thing, especially when it fuels desire. The desire for something you cannot, should not have, is the chink in the armor of your soul, and all I need to make you mine. You will live again very soon. You must have questions. Just one, Mom. How do you live with yourself? By making the universe a better place. No. Seriously. Oh, I'm quite serious. When Meridian was under Phobos's thumb, someone had to take charge to unite the Meridianites and save their world. That was me, not you. And you were created by me entirely for that purpose. Someone had to have a vision, Caleb. On Meridian, that was you. But I play on a larger stage. Only I have the vision to create a perfect universe. All worlds will be united under my rule. No more war or conflict. No injustice or suffering. If I demand obedience, it is only for the greater good. To create a new order. Who, who's that? Cassidy. Or rather, her ghost. But soon, she will live again. Even death bows to my will. 
We have harnessed these hearts. In our hand, they will be an unstoppable force for good. Impressive. Your pride, that is. An arrogance that convinced you that no power, no matter how awesome, was beyond your control. It is the chink in the armor of your soul, Cadmus. No! All I need to make you mine. I promise you more power than you have ever known, Cadmus. But you will use that power for me. Behold the seal of Nerissa! Two hearts to one! Advantage? Mine! The condemned always gets a last meal. Usually the condemned eats it. Don't quibble, Nosh. Hmm. The food is edible. But if you are to avoid oblivion, you avoid it under my control. If I'm gone, my recipes go with me. Mm. Make your choice, Altamir. Oblivion or existence? You seem to have created a flawed copy, Nerissa. I do not have Yan Lin's strength of character. I love her granddaughter. I may even love Zacharias. I cannot give up this life. I choose existence. That is all I need to make you mine. It is over. Time for the knight's power to serve a higher goal. Guardians, unite! Look! I flame! Ember! Fire! Earth! Mistress, please! Tell me the truth. Do you find me attractive? Gorgeous. Ravishing. Beautiful. And you'd do anything to please me? Anything. Yes. Anything. 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 anything you yes, say. Mistress. What more could a girl ask? Ah, Aridia. The perfect planet to add a third heart to my collection. Will you not make another attempt on the heart of Earth, mistress? Ugh, who needs Earth? Every world has a mystic heart. But this world comes without guardians. Fools! What are you waiting for? Help me! Sorry, Nerissa. We're kind of over the whole zombie thing. Pity. You surrendered yourselves to me. My control may have weakened, but not your obligation. I own you all! And I choose to keep what's mine trapped within my seal. Wow, must really be getting crowded in there. Water! Now, all five elements are mine. I am soul guardian of my power. And you? You're done for. Shocking, isn't it? Au revoir. Catch you later, Toots. Cat got your tongue? No! no! He did it! Nerissa's toast and Napoleon's safe. You said a mouthful, Pinky. Okay, really? <laughs> Stop calling me that. Who says there's no such thing as a happy ending? Phobos. And so dawns a new era. The age of Phobos! Who's taking home? They did it! They 
beat him and cracked our jeweled prison. Join hands. If we maintain harmony, we can all escape. Fools! Did they really think I'd given up? Plan, it went quite well. In those forms, you no longer have the will to resist me. You will become my thralls for the conquest to come. Get away with this! Oh, but oh, I but will. will. Kandrakar toppled in a matter of minutes. Poor battered Meridian took even less time. One by one, the worlds will fall. One by one, they will give me their hearts. Until even Earth, with all its technology will have no choice but to acknowledge Nerissa as its queen! I should never have doubted you, love. You did it. You brought order to the universe. With but a few battles, you ended war for all time. I am proud of you, Mother. As always, Nerissa chose power over harmony, and thus remained trapped even as we achieved freedom. The jewel has become her prison, leaving her with nothing but her dreams of conquest. I hope she and her fantasies will be very happy together. 